hello 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 my love bugs once again it's your girl Lumi love here with another message from the divine as i always say today if you're hearing my voice i ask that you harden out your heart for i'm just a messenger and we are all here to witness and learn thank you guys for your likes subscribe shares views and memberships everything is greatly appreciated my loves let's go ahead and get into this read i was going to do an energy read um and then i went to pull out my cards and i kind of pulled out uh some of these cards and um someone is very surprised and shocked or people will be very surprised and shocked about this level up that you're about to get maybe dang maybe in a relationship yeah this is your karmic justice your answers are being your prayers are being answered um and these are people who you know try to doubt you try to cheat you maybe <clears throat> out of a relationship out of money out of something but i was hearing that usher uh tell me again tell me again now can we'll be lovers and friends oh it's a good look baby oh yeah tell me again baby show you right for there will be lovers and friends oh it's a good look baby i can't sing both parts and i was trying to but <laughs> he said sometime would it be your love or sometime would it be your friend sometime would it hold just slow dance hold hands while the record spins something about you make him feel so comfortable <laughs> okay so now this person maybe they want to say that they want to claim that you know damn why is it shock is somebody shocked that you about to have an upgrade, okay? That you about to be somebody's wife. You about to be somebody like power wife and a power couple. And that's everything you ever asked for. And this person tried to cheat you out that shit. And this person's very shocked that you're going to be able to get that. They want to be lovers and friends again. They want to keep your ass in a third party again. But you took back your energy. That's why you got this level up in this social status, okay? Somebody was out here trying to get some... Oh, Okay, you got a new offer coming. It could be in, like, business or you got a new baby coming, child, whatever it is. Okay, this person thought it was going to be easy to maybe poison you with some food. This person was going to try to trick you, maybe ask you out on a date, try to see if y'all could be lovers and friends again, put some in your drink so you can cheat with them, and then they feel like they'll have success. They can bind themselves back to you because they're awakened that you have this brand new start, and they want to try to blackmail you to try to try to, try to to try to knock you out your spot. Somebody want to try to knock you off your pedestal is what I heard. Somebody said you thinking you are a motherfucker fucking that okay <laughs> who is this hater this is somebody that you are being spiritually protected from divinely protected from because they kept trying to curse and hex your ass and kept trying to spiritually attack you in the past this person thought they were going to be able to trick you out your spot but it did not happen okay now let's see they wanted to say you were some sort of secret witch doctor <laughs> This person has a mental illness, or maybe they tried to cause you a mental illness. What's going on? Yeah, they got a real big ego because you don't want to celebrate with them no more. You don't want to lay with them no more. You ain't going to be in no third party with their ass. And they want to be lovers and friends again, okay? Sometimes want to be your love, or sometimes want to be your friend, okay? This person likes how you're physically affectionate. They claim that they want to give you some deep strokes, that they want to kiss you. That they dream about you at night. I'm going to keep it a bean. I'm going to keep it a bean right here. When this person said deep strokes, I heard you say, how can you go deep? How? <laughs> so this person really might be, yes, full of that ego. Maybe you made this person feel real good about themselves. Because you know that one part of Usher song that was like, ah, 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 Whatever he said. So maybe you made him feel real good. Maybe you boosted up his ego. Maybe, you know, when y'all was lovers and friends, you was making this man feel like he was rocking your world, child. Maybe he was doing something a little good, but now you're getting something a whole lot better. This man is jealous, okay? Now he feel like he dream about you at night. He can't stop dreaming about you. You make him hard. He want to play with your nipples. He infatuated with you. He remember how you keep your, love, your, 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 your toes and your nails done. He want to pretend like he looks up to you because he's going through some sort of maybe i'm hearing financial hardship right now and you got your bag and that's why he mad see this person want to try to come and do some secret binding to your ass but he's already been evicted is what i heard so he already been pushed out of your energy because of yours 
your divine protection. Your spirits pushed this man out your energy. They told you, get away from him because he's trying to change your fate. He's trying to be sneaky. He's trying to fuck up your destiny. And it's it's not for you to be loving on him. It's not for you to be taking care of him, okay? You was giving him good cootie mama, which was very healing energy for him. This person ain't worth a damn. That's what I had. Ain't worth a damn. This person thought he was smarter than you. He thought he could play up under you. And for a while, he was doing it. He felt like when he first got that cootie mama, he, I'm telling you, you made this man feel like he was rocking your world, child. And I'm hearing he need to learn a new skill. Or maybe he feel like if he didn't rock your world back then, he learned a new skill and he going to rock it now. Yes, he did. He said, somebody rocking, knocking the boots. All right, five of swords. He's trying to betray you. Uh, give me some good luck. And uh, also trying to give you an STD. <clears throat> That's what I'm getting with this fighting conflict. You'll beat his ass behind some stuff like that. Like, I'm really getting this man trying to get a victory, a pointless victory, by giving you an STD to try to prove that he's still knocking boots with you. Y'all have always been third party. It ain't never stopped. So that he can get some sort of type of social status, some sort of high status. Okay, maybe he could possibly be in some sort of cult. Or maybe he can be possibly involved in some sort of, uh, I'm hearing bros before hoes, tight ass clique. That feels like that they need to be over a feminine. They need to control the feminine. And if you give him your energy uh, with your cootie mama, then you're going to be able to lift his social status up again. And give him karmic justice. He's trying to switch it. He's trying to, he's trying to flip it for you, okay? He doesn't like the fact that you're going to be stable in another relationship with somebody who actually cares about your ass somebody who actually out here working hard to make your life better for you because they want to take some time to relax with you too they want to take some time to get away from these karmic ass people and just have some time to recuperate okay these people feel like you is the finest thing walking okay they love they want to love on you they want to hug on you and they feel like you be throwing that thing back how you should be this person over here feel like if they if they miss this opportunity with you they gonna be heartbroken this person over here feels like they missed this opportunity with you and they heartbroken and this person feel like nah i ain't gonna be looking like you feeling like you hell no nah, what i tell you this the one i'm hearing um what it was the love below okay <laughs> this person's upset you don't want to be in a third party with them and this person here is making plans for you okay let's see what we got going on now we already know what the other person over here talk about okay this person want to get all up and in your business this person swear they learned some sort of new skill so they're gonna be able to long stroke you i'm really thinking this person is doing some sort of love magic and they're gonna make you think you're getting long stroke honey and in real life it's not gonna be that's why these keep coming out they like to the trick this person is trying to trick you over here with some sort of love spell what we got on this other person over here what they okay the time is right yeah <laughs> <laughs> this is the person that you're actively getting down with the get down with okay this person said the time is finally right for y'all now so like i said this person has been planning working hard and he coming in yeah he want to take a trip y'all get some time to recuperate oh this person thought he won't smack on that ass <laughs> he said he likes to touch he said he know he can make that cootie mommy wet all right he said he cannot wait to love on you because this is what he's been wanting to do he also said your fellatio is the best okay honey that's how you show that you fucks with him and he said he fucks with that all right he said you are his only love he be out here sticking up for you because i bet this bastard be trying to talk mess about you okay this masculine also says he loves your smile what is really going on what is really going on? Your energy gives him hope. He wants you to bend that thing over. Uh, he said he bet he, he bet you taste like fruit. And he want to know what to do to please you. Okay, so meanwhile, we got this hater over here. We got a man who's heartbroken that's trying to go. Okay, so you basically just got two people in your energy right now. Who going hard? Who battling? Who beefing? I'm hearing battle of the bands. <laughs> battle of the bands. Oh, my God. This person's trying to pretend like they got some money. This person trying to pretend like they got some money. And this one's like, nah, I really got the success. It is what it is. See, this person can only get money off of your energy. This person is a copycat. This person can only take from you. This person right here can give and multiply just like you can, Okay. All right, give us something else on this hater over here. What else we need to know about him before we block this out? Yeah, you know the truth about this person. You know this person thinks that they're smarter than you. They try their hardest to pretend to be smarter than you. You have a strong, a more strong character than this person has. I dropped some cards, y'all. Hold on. Yeah, but your character is a lot stronger than this other masculine. And I think that's what really, like, drives him. Yeah, that's what really drives him crazy. Because he want to have control over you. This person's all about control. Ooh. But this person's all about love. Okay, he said he never knew what he was missing. But when y'all started kissing, he found. <laughs> 
I don't know how she did that. Well, I know how she did it, but come on, y'all. Yeah, Keish Cole, <laughs> she did her thing. Well, yes, he found you, okay? Yes, very confident, self-disciplined, okay? That's good news for this masculine. You can bring him inner peace. He ain't got to worry about you out here giving your cootie mommy to everybody, okay? He know that this man was mad, co-spiring against you. I told you because he had to stick up for you. Co-spiring against you because he was upset. This man's intuition told him, listen, this is the person that's been trying to attack your feminine. This is the person who has invested all kind of bullshit into trying to take her stability from her, maybe help her get blackballed in the community by talking about her to other people, all right? And this masculine want to bring some justice to your life. This is your event angel all right this other one over here he just want to see where you going with your gift with your money what you doing he wants to explore new territories now maybe this person might have got out of an old relationship and want to come back around to you maybe this person just feel like once again i'm trying to sneak around and creep around so let me come and holler at you let me send you a good message in that you know i got my stuff together and i never should let you go face ass and this other masculine is like bro before you even get a oh, listen this person might have been talking around this other individual about you telling him about how he gonna bring in some good news he want to work with you he gonna find out where you at but i'm hearing to no avail this person been trying to find out where you been and he can't find out shit this one over here know where you at this one over here can call you this one over here be doing things with you behind closed doors honey and the doors is closed because nosy motherfuckers like this this mask can know he's y'all are gonna celebrate he said he gonna manifest his new start with you before this one over here can even blink because you his lady okay that cootie mommy only get wet for him he said he know it ain't gonna work on him Okay, and this man know he really can't hit you up. He mentally in prison. He just saying that to see where y'all really at, okay? So he trying to test the waters with this mask and to see how 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 hard y'all digging each other. Because this person really trying to come over here and get in your pockets, cause some sort of illusion, set you up and sabotage you, honey. This person is just utterly upset and heartbroken and heavily burdened because he can't have his way with you. He can't come get no more cootie mama and take your energy and multiply to make himself look better. All right, with this bootleg ass love offer he trying to send before you partner up with your life partner, your power couple partner. All right, you and this individual over here can make magic. Okay, I'm hearing, do you believe in magic? Y'all can make magic together. Y'all will make magic together because both of you guys have the courage and strength to be a power couple, to have this money and do what you're supposed to do with it. Y'all, I got to go cook me something to eat. But yes, <laughs> this is going to be a good outcome for you, honey. Okay, Holy Spirit said we need to look and see how this masculine was trying to cause you some strife. So let me grab my other deck. And I am going to go put my pizza in the oven, child, and then come up and do some more reads for y'all. <laughs> I got to let my food cook. I'm hungry. Let's see. So we got to look and see what kind of witchcrafty craft craft this masculine over here was doing on you to try to keep you away from this man and why he feels the need to, you know, try to test the waters. He's blocked out, obviously. He want to test the waters and see by how you, ooh, you and this, ooh, wow, crazy, weird, okay? <laughs> woo, this, woo, okay, this, this, good lord. Jesus. Okay, this person over here got some dirty pipes. They tried to hire people maybe to come in. Okay, dirty pipes. That mean they got an STD. Okay, they tried to hire some people to come in and rob you. This person could be uh, doing this with a couple of their fake family members trying to get them to rob you. Uh, and this person can also like to um, uh, I'm not going to say what I heard specifically, but this person don't need to be around nobody's kids. Not even theirs. Okay. Woo. Anything else? This is this. <laughs> what she said? This is bananas b a n a n i said this is bananas yes trying to spread lies to get uh attention spread lies about you trying to make you gain weight all that spell work they was doing is broken because they were doing it for no reason against somebody who was innocent okay it bounced back to them my goodness my gracious y'all this is it this is all my loves i'm gonna go ahead and take this one down well i'm gonna go ahead and upload this one you know take the thing that I, I got i got to go i got to go cook me some pizza i'm hungry so let me put my pizza in the oven and i'm gonna come back and do y'all another read okay